things that you will need um, so that you can be successful in this course. So I do want to start off with you guys um, with letting you know that we've got some procedures that we're going to have to adapt for this second semester. Um, there were a number of students that didn't pass in the first semester. Um, obviously, you guys did, but the Anatomy 2 course is a little bit harder than the Anatomy 1. Um, and so the campus just wants to make sure that you're a little bit more prepared for the Anatomy 2. Um, with that in mind, hopefully everybody has had a chance already to look at your syllabus. Um, if you have not had a chance to look at your syllabus, I would encourage you to do that as quickly as possible. Um, there is going to be a significant amount of information in the syllabus um, that you are going to need to access on a daily basis. So I want to share with you guys really quick the part of the syllabus that you should be looking at, even if you don't look at anything else. Um, and that is... right here. So in your syllabus on page eight, you have a week by week breakdown of your assignments. Um, this week is the first week of classes. You already have a discussion assignment, a lab safety quiz, and an activity. So you have at least three assignments. Um, and I believe this PAL might also be another assignment. So you have three to four assignments this week. They are due next week, or I'm sorry, this uh, Sunday, if I'm correct, okay? Now, what I'm going to need from you guys is as you are completing the assignments, you need to let me know which assignments are completed. And so one of the things that I'm being asked to do is to keep track of what assignments you're getting done, okay? So if this is Carolina and it's week three, and she hasn't done the week one assignments, then you and I and your parents are going to conference and find out why it is that you're behind, okay? Um, you need to be keeping up with your assignments and the extra step that you're gonna do is just letting me know. Now, that's going to be part of your attendance. So for example, on Thursday, your attendance is going to be, today, your attendance is going to be, have you reviewed the syllabus? you're going to answer yes or no. Now, if you answer no, then I'm gonna follow up with you and ask why you haven't done the syllabus. On Friday, your attendance is gonna be, which activities have you completed? And you're gonna let me know, I've done all three, I've done the lab safety, I've done the lab activity, whatever it is that you've done, but that's how we're going to manage the attendance and also allow me to check in on your assignments. Um, because Ms. Gomez is asking me to make sure that you guys are getting the work done to be successful in this class. Um, you guys not doing well in this class is not to your benefit. Um, and it really ends up hurting you in the long run with GPA and having to retake courses and things like that. And we don't want that for you guys. We want you all to be successful. Um, the other thing that I wanna go over with you guys really quick is that I have a copy of the syllabus. So every week what I'm going to do is I'm going to create materials for you. And so this week is the endocrine system. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna up, upload um, study guides, I'm gonna upload videos, just anything that can help you and support you in your understanding of that system that you're covering for the week. If you don't need it, awesome. If there's something that you can get from it, awesome. If there's something that you say, you know what, Ms. Brown, this video helped, but I would prefer if you could talk it through with me or if you could explain it to me, let me know. I will be here online available for you guys Tuesdays and Thursdays. So Tuesdays and Thursdays at 1.50, you will have to come and check in, okay? Even if it's just to say, hey, I'm still alive, everything's cool, I'm good to go. Um. Okay, sorry, I was just looking at the chat. No, I'm not muted. Um, so hopefully that'll help um, because we want you to be successful. Now, those of you that are seniors in this class, um, you know that you're really coming up close on graduation um, and your classes will have to be graded early. 
Um, so you cannot get behind on those assignments. For those of you that are juniors, we're looking at ranking. We're looking at your final courses at, for your senior year. So you're going to want to make sure that you're keeping on top of these things. Um, so for example, today, once we're done with this, I'll be posting the discussion question. I'm sorry, not the discussion, the attendance question. Have you reviewed the syllabus? And then you'll respond yes or no. Um, the other thing that we'll do is, like I said, every day the question will be about what have you completed in class or what support do you need from me? Okay. And so this is just an one additional expectation that we're going to have from you because you're taking the anatomy course at Carter. Any questions, guys? Okay, so your Pearson was outdated, or not outdated, it was closed because semester one was over. What they've told me is that the Pearson Connect should now be active again, and that it should be the same code from last semester, you just need to reactivate it. Um, yeah, so you should be able to just use the same code from last semester because it was a year-long license. So you're still good. If you used it last semester, you should be able to use it this semester. The teacher had just um, had not posted anything yet, and that's because you couldn't access it. Um, Esteban, you can go back to school whenever you want. The school is open. Um, we have teachers there Monday through Thursday. So uh, the school is actually, anybody who wants to go back to school can go back to school. Um, I will tell you that if you go back to school, you're not going to be with your teachers. Um, what we are doing is the first five or the first, excuse me, the freshmen and the juniors go with Mr. Barrera on the days, like I'm there on Tuesdays and Thursdays um, with one teacher and the freshmen and the juniors go with another teacher. So we're splitting them up by grade level. So sophomores and seniors and freshmen and juniors, and they're with one teacher in the morning, they go to lunch and then they're with another teacher in the afternoon. Um, but you are always able to go to school. And the campus is open Monday through Thursday. Uh, okay, Yossi, you got a new booklet. Last year, I tried the lockdown browser on my laptop, and it didn't work. Um, okay, so Carolina and anybody else that had a problem with the lockdown browser? Let's see, Giselle, Carolina, Esteban. Anybody else that's having problems with the lockdown browser? Esteban, Genesis, Kayla. Okay, so let me see what we can do. Um, it may be that I know one of the things that they that I've seen online is you have to log out of your school account and log in with your STC account. So that might be something, but I'm going to verify with the tech and then I'll post it um, on the announcements in here whenever I get like an official answer, because I don't want to tell you to do that. And then that's not the right answer. Um, but that is one of the things that I've seen. Any other questions, guys, or any any other issues or concerns that we need to go over? Okay, so what I was saying at the very beginning was that hopefully you've gone over the syllabus already. And you've looked at your assignments that are due this week. Um, so this week you've got three to four assignments. I'm not exactly sure um, on the last one, but you've got a discussion, a lab safety and a lab activity due this week. So one of the things that I'm going to ask you for Friday um, for the attendance question is, have you completed those assignments um, or which of those assignments have you done? Um, the goal is for you guys to not get behind. Um, and to make sure that you're on top of things. And so we want to make sure that you're checking in with me so that if you do get behind, we can help you um, because you guys have a lot of, of stuff at stake right now. Um, juniors, you've got to start thinking about your ranking. Seniors have got graduation coming up. Um, so this is a really important semester for you guys. Um, also, I just want to let you know, like the sessions that are going to be recorded. So if for whatever reason you can't come to the session, then the session will be recorded and it'll be posted under the materials. Okay. Any other questions, folks? All right. 
So what I'm going to do is as soon as I log out of here, I'm going to go ahead and post the attendance question for today. Look, remember, the question today is going to be, have you looked over your syllabus? And hopefully you have. And that way you can start working on um, getting yourselves ready and getting geared up and not getting behind this first week. All right. So uh, we will see you guys on Tuesday. And please make sure that you're getting your work done. Bye, guys. Bye.